Battle, Monteverdi, right off a strong, ball flicked in field, turning around again, Bugatti, trying to get something going here for Barden. Monteverdi looks to steal it, but he didn't get the drive, did he? In comes Barden again in the shape of Bugatti. In behind the Lazali Capellas there, still two Bartos in front. The shot by Bugatti, sent down towards the goal. They go back to defend it. Shake and make this there. The ball's going towards the line. Back on off the goal line by Barto Castagnola, but only as far straight into Mateus Machado. Machado surely with a hit to the goal. Shot is good. Good pressure from Barden early in this opening chucker. Two minutes gone. One nil to the team in black. Huge drive. Look at this. A country mile by Capella. Running onto a Barto out to the right is Machado. It's a race now. Down to the bottom left hand corner. They go down, the, down towards the clubhouse. It is Barto Castagnolo. Will he check up and come back in field? Still there with Barto. Machado's with him. Tom Bohr is in there as well. Monteverdi will help out his teammate. Monteverdi. Barto still there. Machado's chasing. There's a cut shot. Look at this from Barto. It's looking pretty good from here. Oh, where's that gone? Oh, it's gone wide. Oh, that would have been a goal, wouldn't it? That was about 30 yards from the back line. On the angle, just out to the left-hand side just wide hang on hang on the umpires are saying that's in the goal is being given what a goal oh boy word it's a pity there was such a, a little bit of a delay on that but anyway the goal is good from Barto Castagnola what a goal 1-1 one, one. I promise you that was no more than 30 yards from the back line the angle was so tight and the distance was about 90 yards plus Horse looks nice and relaxed, ears pricked, going towards the ball. Here he goes. This is for 2-1. It's along the ground, didn't get any height on that. Monteverdi got a little touch on it, it's in the goal mouth. Capella's there with Pegatti, Barto's there. They need to clear it. Barto, cool as you like, will flick this ball in. If you look at this play by Barto Castagnola, put that horse, the ball into the horse's neck and sends it upfield. Towards Sheikh Mehta. In comes Capella. Getting away from Machado who's looking for the umpire's whistle. Here comes Capella with Fran Elizalde. Elizalde goes over the top. Just goes over the side. Out of play. Unlucky. It's going to be a white hit. UAE now. Can they get something going with two minutes? Less remaining. 1-1 one, one to score. Capella with the call for UAE. Here's another big drive. It's a rocket sent down to the goal. Lukin Monteverdi. Bartos there. Lukin. A little top. What a play by Capella. Well, that was 140 yards. Maybe even 140.3 to be precise. And it went Lukin Monteverdi. A little touch was all that was required. And, oh, the goal is good. 2-1. UAE. Matias. This time it's long and hard out to the far side now trying to find Bigatti. Going forward is Elizalde. Bigatti finds it first time and Elizalde is free. Chasing out to the left hand side is Capella. The ball sent down to the go down towards the goal here. Capella needs a backhand. What a play by Alfredo Capella. He turns it around but Machado will get there first. Taken on by Monteverdi. Got a clever by Machado. Around the corner houses he comes. Still with Machado. There's a shot to go. Capella goes back there but he can't get there in time. And what a play by Matthias Machado. The goal is good and Barden have the lead again. Three goals to two. Well... The hit by Fran Elizalde, the pass from Bugatti, superb. Far side, the ball is in play. Lukin Monteverdi trying to get the break on Bigatti, the 15-year-old down the Duke's ground. It's still with Lukin Monteverdi. He has the cheek to look around and see where Bigatti is. As cool as you like, pops it up into the goal. And that is wonderful from this young man who is a polo star in the making. Well, he's a polo star already, but he's going to head. He, he's heading up to the highest, I'm sure, this guy. 4-3, UAE. Capello will waste no time. Lukin's going to a fresh mount. And there's the big drive by Capello. Got a lot of height on that. Not much distance. And it drops down. Back to work for Bugatti. Very good control by Alfredo. Brings it around. 
Bart's almost there, Bugatti fires from distance. Has he got it this time? Yes, he has. And that's wonderful from Alfredo Bugatti. Well, he had a little slider a while ago, didn't he? He put the ball out to the right-hand side, and from about the same distance this time, down the middle it goes. 5-4, game on again on the Duke's ground. Bugatti, very, very good. Back in business now. Come Bart and get one before the end of the chucker. Not at the moment because Bartow has the call. Lukin's in behind, so he has support. Monteverdi's there being behind. Bartow fires from a long, 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 long way out. And that's wonderful from Bartow Castagnola. The big drive, that was a good 80 or 90 yards. He looked up, had a look, seen where the goalposts were, and down the middle he sent it. Beautiful. Oh, the horse just stopped there as he went in to hit it. And they put it high, didn't get it high enough. And what a stop. And I think it was Lukin who stopped it. And there's the pass by Capello. What a play by Lukin Monteverdi. And now he has the call. He's called off him behind by Barto. But Lukin sent forward. Barto with the call. Taken on by Machado. Still with Castagnola. He scored one from there earlier. Just shanked that one infield a little bit there. And he probably should have let Lukin go forward there, shouldn't he? In comes Capello. And Elizalde's horse kicks it one way. Then the other. Fran Elizalde with the ball. Kicking on by Alfredo Capella. In there goes Bugatti as well and Barton have got away with that one oh the back counted the stolen ball from Elizalde by Barto and he'll just run this one in and it's going to be nine goals to UAE four to Barton and well how fortunes change a moment ago less than 30 seconds ago you might even say they had a penalty from 40 yards a penalty three it was stopped by Monteverdi he took the ball forward call off by Castagnola anyway the end on suing play and Barto stole it from Elizalde and walked it in for a goal. Nine, four, five goals of difference. Barton have a lot of work to do. Brings it forward. Drives another one along the ground. Didn't get quite get a hold of it up, but enough to find Castagnola. Just deflected there. Comes in now for Fran Elizalde. Barton retained possession. Still with Elizalde. Mateus will try and take care of Castagnola. Oh, he's picked his pocket again, has Barto. That's twice he's done it in the chucker on Fran Elizalde. Now it's a race between the pair. He keeps this ball in close quarters. Near side, offside, goes to the offside again. Look at this from Barto Castagnola. He's left Elizalde for the dead. Barto Castagnola. That is brilliance. Pure brilliance from Castagnola. It's 10-4. Wow, what can I say? This time he fires it up again, looking for Luke Keane, the huge drive, 130 yards even up there. Gomes next player is Machado de Vacan by Mateus, turning onto a shaker Mesa in company with Fran Elizalde. Elizalde has Capella to deal with. Going forward, there's a little weighted pass for Bugatti. This is very good teamwork, and that's a very, very good goal by Alfredo Bugatti. That's the way they play polo. Keep it nice and simple. Beautiful pass from Elizalde to his teammate Bugatti. First time, goal is good. It's 10-5. Grandstand seating, and that includes car parking. And the ball is in play for the start of the fifth. Chucker Fran Elizalde has the ball for Barden from the roll-in. Taken on by Barto Castagnola. Mateus Machado straight away taken on by Capella. Elizalde tries to get it, brings it around. Capella's looking for the hook. Fran Elizalde left. Little touch by Barto will find Capella. Now Capella will look for a big one. He's got the drive and away he goes. UAE looking to go over to the perfect start here. It is Alfredo Capella. The ball bouncing on Kindly. It doesn't matter for Capella. Which way it bounces, he's going to score anyway. The goal is good from Big Al and that's another beauty for UAE. It's 11 goals to 5. And again, it was Carsten Yola in there working in unison with Capella who made that goal for Big Al to go down field and score. 11-5 to score. UAE looking good again, aren't they?
deservedly get that goal to make it 12-7. Five goals of difference. The ball is in play again. Three and a half minutes remaining. Here comes Fanny Lazelli trying to get away from, from Alfredo Capella. Bigatti called him off. There's the pass by Bigatti from Lazelli. Elizalde now going down towards the target. Just bounced behind him, couldn't get a hold of it. Capella is gone in anyway. Capella couldn't play the backhand. He couldn't get there. Elizalde did enough. I think the horse might even score that one. And so 12 8, three minutes remaining. Four goals the difference. Well, it's still a very hard task. It's a steep mountain for the team in black. But one never can tell. Castagnola's pass out to the right-hand side, cuts it there for Alfredo Capella, who has space. He'll be taken on by Alfredo Bigatti. First time hit by Capella. Now, look at Barto coming through on a flyer. It is Castagnola. Can he control it? Pasto, Castagnola, look at this, it's still there. Castagnola for another beauty. Castagnola! Wonderful from Castagnola. The pass from Capello, wonderful. And the control in the stick book again from this nine goal maestro. Superb. It's 13 goals to wait, and that will seal it for UAE.